My name is Tim Martin from Dallas, Texas, and I'm here as a uh, witness, a friend of uh, Wits Ministry and Sir Timothy Thrapp. The point of me uh, talking on this video is basically to uh, confirm Wits' uh, intentions uh, uh, having to do with solving world problems and their technology, uh, which I have seen and witnessed working and was very impressed. My background is I've been a uh, entrepreneur for uh, almost 30 years now, all related to uh, technical industries, software, computers, uh, electronics, and uh, for the last uh, nine years, eight or nine years, uh, my focus has been on uh, alternative energy, particularly in uh, motors and over unity rotating machines uh, using magnets and magnetic fields. When I came across uh, this technology from WITS, it really made my eyes open. And uh, I've, when I heard Sir Timothy's uh, speaking about some of the technology, it was uh, very impressive. And I could tell that he, uh, he knew something that uh, I didn't know uh, from my uh, previous years of working uh, and researching this, these devices. I came up for a uh, demonstration of the technology and was so impressed that uh, I decided to help them in any way I can to get this out to people. It's been way too long uh, suppressed and ignored and basically not believed in. We've got to start opening our minds to uh, these types of possibilities because that's probably one of the biggest factors that's keeping this technology down. I witnessed uh, some of the same materials that you can probably witness on the website now, but uh, uh, both the, uh, the uh, generator that put out uh, close to 900 watts, the uh, li uh, delay line motors, there were no tricks involved. These are, these are actually working devices that don't have hidden wires or hidden batteries. The intentions of the ministry and Sir Timothy are exactly as they say. Uh, there is no misrepresentation here, and uh, that's really why I'm doing this. I can't express the uh, uh, importance of the technology uh, for our world today and our planet. We need to get this out. Our leaders and our governments and our uh, big corporate businesses are not going to do this. So it's, it's the people that are going to have to make this decision and they're going to have to get behind this and make it happen. Uh, and, I, and I believe uh, WITS working as a ministry with their expertise uh, and experience for so many decades in this field is the, is the best thing that I've come across in my eight or nine years. It's, it's almost like uh, I kind of found the, the treasure chest of technology here. So uh, I guess I want to urge everyone to get behind this, uh, this cause. I, I can't think of a more important cause right now uh, that is uh, practically dire that we, uh, we get behind it and get this out. So uh, anyway, that's what I wanted to say. Again, I am te very technically inclined. I've, I've examined the, uh, the handful of devices that I've seen thoroughly. And it's just mind-boggling when you see it in person, and we need to get it in the hands of people so they can benefit from it. So uh, get behind this cause today, as soon as you can, any way you can, and uh, really appreciate it. Thank you very much. Hi, my name is Olin Geiser, and I live in Dalton, Ohio. Uh, I'm a farmer and also I've worked in the service industry repairing electronics and electrical equipment for 35 years. Uh, so I'm somewhat of a tinker. I like computers and I've done some computer programming. Uh, I got interested in alternative energy a number of years ago and exploring it didn't find anything I could really get a grasp on uh, until I met Timothy Trapp. Uh, and I had a, visited his lab, he showed me some demonstrations such as uh, 
using an insulator for a conductor, which I had never seen before, never thought possible. Uh, he showed me some things with magnetic uh, fields that I had never been aware of before. Uh, he showed me some of his uh, motors that he ran uh, over Unity on a battery and then disconnected the battery and they still ran. Uh, I've helped him build a couple controllers for some of his projects, so I know that there's no uh, hidden wires or things that he's using to, to try and trick people. Um, I do believe this uh, technology is viable and useful and that it, we do need to get it out and that the only way is for individuals to do it. This is not something that a government is going to do, something that a large corporation is going to do. It's something that the people themselves have to do because they want to help themselves. So I would just encourage you to support this ministry and uh, that's it. Thank you.